Greetings and welcome, fellow horsemen, to another episode of Let's Play Darksiders 3. We've defeated the Tempest. Now we are looking for Wrath. Hey, finally we are on the other side of this grating. So that means we now have a different way of getting there. To the drilling nexus. Right? Going up. Who knew the apocalypse would have so many elevators? Ah, must you fill the silence with your chatter? Are you suggesting the Great Fury does not enjoy the pleasure of my company? Pleasure is not the word I'd use. You wound me, mistress. Have I not been the voice of guidance on this mission? No. I will admit, you are not completely useless. You flatter me, mistress. Don't get used to it. Sounds like a terrible battle, which means we'll be running headlong towards it. <laughs> You're learning! I could have loved you, Fury. Back here. All right, he heals whenever one of those other combatants dies. So.
Get your pattern under control. Where is the anger? How can you fight without anger? Thanks for the assistance. Watching, not speaking. Huh. We're all learning something on this little sojourn. Woohoo! Let's just spend that right away. This is kind of exciting. I never really got this high in my previous playthroughs. Because uh, I believe my highest level was 37. But that was before I got the Crucible DLC. So it wasn't really grinding all that much. Uh... Let this be more than two points behind. Uh, yeah, let's get down to Valkrim. Jerry's got something to say. Talk of your exploits travels far, Horseman. Targon wishes to see you. Does he now? Most urgently, it seems. Hmm, or you lose out on your cut. My cut? After all we've been through together, you think I... Of course it affects my cut. Please pay the Crucible a visit. Daddy wants a new pair of Soul Slick shoes. You are filth. Oh my, indeed. Filth who knows where the good money is. If you're willing to play. Yay! All right, the last leg of the crucible is available. What would you ask of this? Take your time. Yeah. And now pieces of adamantine are available, as well as piece of an essence of chosen. You know what? Let's just buy it all. I knew you couldn't resist. An excellent choice. I've not really got anything else. As you wish. This the, I need 55,000 for a next level. As you wish. <laughs> right, so. Well, we are mostly done in the scar, I think. There is still some things I want to do. So first off. Greetings. Please take your time. Let's see, where is what exactly? No lands, no dust holes. Hmm. Quite a dust hole. Because we have a secondary objective here. The Hollow King has asked us to deal with the demon. The demon is somewhere in this area. 
I just need to remember how to get to him. I don't need to go this way, do I? Now that the Tempest is defeated, we can actually walk around above ground in this area. Go pick up all the goodies. So nice and quiet. Yeah, it's kind of uh, interesting how there's so many goodies over here that you just cannot reach. Two more levels until that is full. If there's anything else over here. I wasn't paying too much attention to any potential loot that was thrown about because, you know, big tornado. I think there might be one or two other good pickups still lying about. Just to see them. Something over there, I think. Yeah, for this area, having a horse would have been nice. But energetic artifact, not gonna say no to one of those. This, whoa, this doesn't lead anywhere. Right, rather than one or two good pickups, there's one good pickup. I guess, I mean, the luminous visage helps, but I do I always wonder, would it be worth it just to save them up? Yeah, I don't think I don't think so. Even though the game does encourage you to uh, save up all your uh, goodies until you absolutely necessarily need them. It just feels kind of like a wrong way to play. I mean, why would I not use all my goodies? The strength shards, the thorn shards. I don't think I've ever really found a use for the thorn shards. I mean, it's a neat idea to do damage back to an enemy that hits you, but that does still involve you getting hit by the enemy. That's down here. Ooh, gold bear. Yeah, this place isn't anywhere near as bad if there's not a uh, giant tornado hovering over here. I wasn't paying too much attention. What would you ask of the Please take uh, your let's time. See. Uh, let's try to cast an overlook. I'm essentially guessing where something is. Right now. This is not the right area. What would you ask of please take your time? Let's start a gnarled cliffs. back here. That's also not where I want to be. Uh, Good 
Give me something that I can actually recognize. And that's all we tried. Damn one of these. Demon's Peak. I don't think so. Let's try the Lowlands. I need to look for an area where I opened up a shortcut. I think it's this way. I'm doing. I am enjoying the silence, but it is just very eerie. <laughs> seen that exploding spear throwing guy. If it wasn't so gaudy, it would be quite nice. Another foolish demon building a temple to himself. All hail the conquerors. The cycle continues. Right. At least that tells me we're in the right area. Someone's compensating. Did you just make a joke? This is bad. Even, dare I say with apologies, stupid mistress. What are you so afraid of? It looks to be another would-be demon conqueror. Ah, uh, 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 not would-be, will. Easy, m'lady. There's no need for steel or whips. Another demon with a mysterious agenda. Do you know Volgrim? <laughs> I believe you two would get along. <laughs> no, my lady. Where Volgrim deals in trash, Abraxas trades in class. Ah, my reputation precedes me, I see. <laughs> it does. Someone wants you dead. Ah, they can get in line. The meek always envy the strong. Isn't that right, Water? Lovely, but the Lord of Hollows seems to think you're a meddler. You've seen the traitor? Where? Matters not. What matters is that he wants you dead, and I want to know why. You're a clever woman. It takes but one eye and half an ear to tell, so... I'll give it to you straight. That will be the home of a very, very important demon. 
Someone who will win this war once and for all. And I will stand by his side. The traitor doesn't like that. The traitor fears change. <laughs> Better the devil you know and all that. And what of the traitor? What does the Lord of Hollows want? Sometimes the birds win. Sometimes the bats. Balance. But the traitor... The traitor wants more. The false lord would be a false god. He would hollow this planet as he hollows souls. That is his becoming. He sent you against me because he knows that when my lord is installed, the Braxis will find the traitor and pull the organs from his backside for what he's done. Malady's job is to keep order. The Lord of Hollows believes he is order. If the lady is as the lady does, she should kill the traitor soon, before he rises. But if you're going to surprise me, please get on with it. I have an empire to build. All right. All right, I'm gonna stick with the original plan. You are quite the silver tongue demon, aren't you? The original. <laughs> it shall make a fine trophy then. Suit yourself. Horseman killed by demon man. The world has changed. <laughs> Good luck with your tower, demons. Pray I have no call to come back. So I kind of want to look around in that throne room a little bit more. Well, it's certainly cleared out this corpse quickly enough. Eee, not a luminous facade.
think that's everything we can do here. Let's go hand in our rewards. There's probably still things I missed here, but that can be done in a separate episode, I think. They did pass through here, right? I don't recall if I did. Yeah, I just never really looked around in this place, I guess. And then we're back here. Alright, let us depart. I think we're relatively close to the uh, the Nexus area. I'm gonna ignore most of the enemies here. me right. greeting please take your time uh, let's That's not where I need to be. The hollows. Let's go there. Let's see how heavy he is with his new soul. By the way, I don't know which wise is good, but this is leading to the good ending. Lord of Hollows, what's happening? Now, answer me! Are you here to end me? You should know. You prophesied it. Yes, I did. And if there was ever a time to strike me down, it is here. Now, before my becoming. So, what comes next, horseman? Eh, I'll spare you. Abraxas said you mean to hollow the earth. That you used me to gain the power to do so. Eh, uh, the demon who speaks true. Now I have seen everything, but Abraxas did not. Tell me. There was a time long ago when I belonged to the Char Council. Liar! Is it so difficult to believe that I could be counted among their number? I was a force for balance, believed in the work of the Council. But after eons, 
Her became disenfranchised. Her feeble lip service toward the very concept of maintaining balance became all too dogmatic. They quickly reduced their focus to policing the forces of heaven and hell. But in doing so, they did not account for humanity. Humanity? They are but- Hairless simian. Yes. Playthings of angels and demons, the forgotten class. But they were meant for so much more. Humans were always meant to embody the universal balance. They were created to evolve. You flatter them. No. They simply do not fear them as others do. Someone means to prevent humanity from reaching its full potential. They did so with this premature war. And the Council? Allowed it to happen, and no. I cannot prove it. It was removed from their ranks long ago. But I heard whispers and saw the signs. Thus I prepared my gathering of souls from angels, from demons, from humans. It's an endeavor meant to offer humanity the opportunity to see its potential realized. My final penance for a lifetime of complicity. Ugh, I don't understand! I am the vessel. You are the guardian. As I said when we met, to achieve balance. And save this world from heaven and hell, one must choose a side. I have chosen mine. It's you, Fury. No! What do you choose? Uh, 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 I choose... Life! It is a good feeling to have a purpose again. Isn't it by becoming? Mysterious stone sigil. The trinket trembles, letting to shatter from the immense pressure of what it contained. Voices call out. All at one, loud roar and quiet as a whisper. You killed him? He was mad. Mad as the rest. Something else you want to tell me, mistress? Yes. I'm tired of demons with delusions of grandeur. Alright. And with that, nothing is explained, but we will call it an episode here. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time. If you enjoy my content, please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all then. Bye.